So, is your dad the milkman? Well, if he delivers milk for a living, there's every chance he is. But if it's just a question you've heard one too many times, there might be an answer for you. Short of DNA testing, which is pretty conclusive but quite expensive, there are a couple of avenues for you to narrow down your paternity. The old kind words of, you've got his eyes, are a good place to start. My colour doesn't follow a pattern, but it does follow a gradient. It's dictated by six or more genes which express themselves as eight colours. The thinking is that lighter eyed parents can't have darker eyed children. However, natural variations in human genes also have the potential to influence eye colour. So whilst it can be used as a rough guide to paternity, it isn't exactly foolproof. Blood type gives a better, more conclusive answer than eye colour. It's a process of elimination. Say the mother has blood type O and the daughter has blood type B, the father can only have A, B or B if the daughter is his. Another avenue is earlobes. Attached earlobes, like these bad boys here, are from a recessive gene. So if both your parents have unattached earlobes, it's impossible for you to have attached earlobes. It's helpful, but vague. There's also the good old fashioned method of intense surveillance. Watching your potential father closely might show up some shared characteristics or personality traits. But again, there's no real proof there. If you have an inkling, I'd suggest just asking him. Unless of course you're lactose intolerant, in which case your dad's almost definitely the soy milk man. I love you dad, whoever you are.